Well, it's official. The biggest Netflix original series ever has been renewed for a second season. Scandals and upper-class quarrels are in store for the costume drama, and fans can hardly wait. You must make haste! But things will not be exactly as they were, as we will be seeing departures by some major characters and introductions of fresher faces. But what will the victims of Lady Whistledown be getting up to in Season 2? I'm Matt Rogers and join me today as we take a look at everything we know about Bridgerton Season 2. Also an obvious spoiler warning for the entire first season. But before we get into it, if you want videos on the latest movies and TV shows delivered straight to your subscription feed, be sure to hit that subscribe button and ring that bell to not miss a single thing. In January of this year, it was confirmed that Season 2 is coming, and shooting would begin in the spring of 2021. But not only that, the show was also renewed for Seasons 3 and 4. With over 82 million households having watched the show, I'm sure Netflix didn't have to think too hard about that one. Due to the pandemic, filming for season 2 obviously faced many obstacles. It was expected that we would see the season premiere at Christmas, but Netflix confirmed this month that the second season will have a premiere date in 2022. But what will actually be happening this season? Well, the good news for fans of the show is that there is a lot of source materials to base the seasons on. For those that aren't familiar, the series is based on the books of the same name by Julia Quinn, and there are quite a few stories that we have yet to explore. At least eight at this point each focusing on different members of the Bridgerton family. In Season 2, we will be following the love life of Anthony Bridgerton rather than Daphne. Phoebe Dinever, who plays Daphne, had this to say on the subject. Quote, We're very much passing on the baton to the lovely Jonathan Bailey, who plays Anthony, and that will be the main storyline of Season 2 and the story arc of Season 2. The show centres around the Bridgertons, and there are eight books, and I think maybe the fans of the books were more aware of that happening than the fans of the show. End quote. Although stepping down as lead, Dinova isn't slowing down and has already booked another lead role in an Amazon original, titled Exciting Times. Based on the best-selling novel of the same name, this show will follow an Irish English teacher working abroad who becomes involved in a complicated love triangle. Some of you may also know that it has been confirmed that the Duke will not be returning at all this season, so it's very likely Daphne will also continue to step back and possibly not return for later seasons. Although we've yet to get an official trailer, a first look at the upcoming season was released this week, showing a glimpse of the main protagonists going head to head, including sex education Simone Ashley as Kate Sharma, the main love interest, who according to Ashley, does not lack passion. Your character is as deficient as your horsemanship. I shall bid you good night. Show creator Chris Van Dusen has called Kate and Anthony's relationship, quote, sweeping and moving and as beautiful as viewers of the first season have come to expect from the show. We left Anthony at the end of the first season at a bit of a crossroads, so I'm looking forward to jumping in and discovering how he fares on the marriage market, end quote. Joining Simone Ashley will be four new characters. The Hollywood Reporter has confirmed that Charitra Chandran will play Edwina Sharma, Kate's younger sister, who's a debutante searching for her true love. Shelley Conn will play Kate and Edwina's mother, Lady Mary Sharma. Callum Lynch will play Theo Sharp, a hard-working printer's assistant. And Rupert Young will play Jack, a new character who isn't actually in the books, who has a connection to one of the show's most notable families. Rupert Evans will play the late Bridgerton patriarch and father of the siblings, Edmund. It's been reported that he will likely be present in Anthony's flashbacks due to the effect Edmund's death had on Anthony. The Bridgerton social media accounts have also treated us to a further look at what season 2 will look like and shared some screenshots, very carefully not giving anything away though. Claudia Jesse, who plays Eloise in the show, has said on the topic of the scripts that people are going to die when this happens and people are going to die when this happens, so it sounds as if we're in for some twists and turns along the way. But with the overwhelming hype surrounding this season, what are you most hoping to see? What characters do you think they need to explore more? I'd love to hear what you think, so let me know. I'll be down there in the comments. But be sure to subscribe for weekly videos covering your favourite movies and TV shows. If you subscribe during this video, then welcome aboard, and if you had a good time hanging out, then spank that like button. This is Matt Rogers, and that is all.